Praise the Lord, beautiful people of God. This morning devotion is entitled, The Marriage Metaphor by Sheridan Vossi. Hear the word of the Lord this morning. Be completely humble and gentle. Be patient, bearing with one another in love. Ephesians 4 verse 2. After 22 years together, I sometimes wonder how my marriage to Marion works. I'm a writer. Marion is a statistician. I work with words. She works with numbers. I want beauty. She wants function. We come from different worlds. Marion arrives to appointments early. I'm occasionally late. I try new things on the menu. She orders the same. After 20 minutes at an art gallery, I'm just getting started. While Marion is already in the cafe downstairs, wondering how much longer I'll be. We give each other many opportunities to learn patience. We do have things in common, a shared sense of humor, a love of travel, and a common faith that helps us pray through options and compromises as needed. With this shared base, our differences even work to our advantages. Marion helps me learn to relax while I help her grow in discipline. Working with our differences has made us better people. Paul uses marriage as a metaphor for the church and with good reason. Like marriage, church brings very different people together, requiring them to develop humility and patience to bear one another in love. And as in marriage, a shared base of faith and mutual service helps a church become unified and mature. Differences in relationships can cause great frustrations in the church and in marriage. But managed well, they can help us become more Christ-like. Our reflection for today. How have differences between you and those close to you help you both grow? How can differences between church members help develop godliness? Let us pray. Gracious God, please use our differences to help us mature. In Jesus' name, amen. Once again, I'm going to encourage you to subscribe to this channel. And please pass this devotion to five new people and encourage them to subscribe as well. God bless you and you have a great day.